Hello, hello, queens and kings. Welcome back. As you all can tell from the title, we're doing some cleaning and then I have a refresh. As you all see here, this is how my TV area looked before, but this is currently how the room looking now while I'm in here trying to do a little bit of cleaning and washing and things like that. So I decided to just go ahead and jump in from here. So I'm giving you guys an overview. Child, look at that fan chandelier child whatever you call it mm, so much dust y'all don't forget about that because y'all can't be saying y'all clean from the ceiling to the bottom no you don't if it's fandelier looking like that but child look at my vanity oh my god this is ridiculous in this room so we gonna jump into girls and that or something bothering me while i'm trying to do this one so it won't let me be great just like the kids here but yeah look, look at that vanity that don't make no sense honey it became a catch-all too everything in here is a catch-all and that's why i gotta do some cleaning and declutter and just get rid of some things let's look at the room look look at that fan yeah. child that fan got dust on it too but anyway so what are we about to do is go ahead and jump into this cleaning in my master bedroom so you got some cleaning to do or whatever girlfriend or you at work or just sitting down relaxing chilling child put me on your tv on your cell phone on your tablet on your kids tablet on your husband phone on your family member share it put me up there let them know we are living over here <laughs> but yes um i hope you queens and kings enjoy this uh cleaning with me the last time that i did a clean with me child i had these same pants on that's sad ain't it they must be my cleaning pants don't y'all tell nobody but god but anyways child <laughs> Anyway, I think I failed at that moment there, but I'm glad I chopped it out. So what I'm doing here is basically taking off my, what is thing called? Chandelier, child. My chandelier off my fan. So it become a uh, fandelier. That's how you say it? I don't know. But a lot of you queens and kings does ask me about this. Mostly queens, though. Mostly queens does ask about this. Did it came like this? Where did I purchase it from or whatever? But I didn't, I just, it was a two-piece. Fan came with the house the ceiling fan and the light came from ross yeah so but what i'm doing now is basically cleaning my ceiling fan getting all that dust off of that honey i have to do this every month i believe every month because this room catch a lot of dust and on top of my bed was a lot of dust so what i'm using here is this microfiber rag that i got from amazon they work pretty well for what it need to do so that's what i'm going to do to collect all the dust right here we don't want to get nothing flying all over the room so I gotta use this microfiber rag to actually look at that. Look, girl, that don't look like that been clean since I moved in. That that is sad. <laughs> that is really sad. All right, y'all. So this little mattress pad here is from Amazon. If you guys do ask me about it, it sleeps very well. It's very comfortable, honey. I be when I first got a girl, oh my God, I was in love, in love, in love. But I'm still in love with it. I actually got one for each one of the rooms. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. And I will link it down below. But uh, I'm going to start running my mouth at this moment here. I'll come back to give y'all a good little more of my commentary a little bit later. Okay? And I feel like it's a little bit important for you guys to know. But if you guys like videos like this, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. So definitely, if you a new queen king, just stop it by. Hello, queen. Hello, king. My name is Valerie, the queen that is running this show over here. So with that being said, I'm going to let y'all enjoy the rest. I'll be back.
Listen, y'all. I love my husband. I truly do. But he about worse than the kids, honey. Look. Look what he did to my damn table. Girl, I could have. I died on the inside. I couldn't let him sit on the outside because I just died. Don't you know how fast I went to Amazon looking for another one? They did not have another one. Oh, girl, I tell you guys, just don't do right. They just don't do right. Now this, 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 uh, baby. It was a bright idea when I decided to do this. But <laughs> as you all can see, like I said in the beginning, it's another catch-all. And everything is over here that that shouldn't be over here. Let me just say that. But I've been brainstorming. Y'all know how I do. I get into this little head of mine and it go to work and it go to work. I come up with all types of ideas, but this time I'm going to challenge you all to give me some ideas because I'm tired. Thank you. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired. I need something to help me to declutter so therefore it don't look like this. Because this is a whole lot, a whole lot of, and I'm not with that. I, I wanted it to be simplified. I need to bring these um, palettes down. I did see where someone a long, 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 long time ago had like this mirror fouling box that um, Home Goods have. And I promise you, when I go at Home Goods, I ain't gonna find that. But I guarantee you, I see it on somebody else's YouTube channel right about now after I don't mention it again. So hopefully I can find that because that's the idea that I have so I can put all my palettes and stuff in there. But I'm gonna find another way to declutter this because this is not the beat for me. And I don't, look, look at it. This don't make no damn sense. Turn me inside out, out, make my heart beat. Leave no one else. You're all I need. Personality, everything you do gives me love. Everything about you.
Okay, I'm convinced. I'm convinced. Now, ain't nobody can tell me nothing different. Nobody. Anything that have a surface is a catch-up. Anything. And where you got to find a spot to put something down is a catch-all. Because, baby, this shouldn't even look like this over here. But it did. It did. It really did. It don't make no sense. It don't make no sense. Everything is a catch-all. I'm convinced. What y'all say? Definitely the queens. I know we got some kings out there that do some cleaning too. I like to see when a man clean up. I really do. I like to see when they be doing it. Anyways, I almost went somewhere with that. But um, y'all, y'all let me know <laughs> what become y'all catch all in y'all homes and stuck. I'm afraid to get out this voice bill. Y'all get this thing for voice bill. This voice over. I'm about to get in some trouble. Bye. I'll see y'all at the end. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoying this commentary and everything in this video. Care about bye. bye. So here is the completed clean room now. And I'm show you guys the pretty much the update that we did. And here is the update. So for the update, as you all can see, um, it's still some things that I still want to change a little bit or move around a little, not move around, but um, I actually want to bring the team up a little bit more, even though that my canvas is up there. So, mm, I really don't want to get rid of my canvas, but the look uh, aesthetics that I'm going for, I may have to move the canvas out the way. Um, but so far, so good. It looked pretty good. I'm actually thinking about painting this wall here black. Um, yeah, think about painting that wall black. So therefore, this pretty much blend in, but it does pop all at the same time. So we're not going to get like no big dresser is because we want this to be open. We want the room to feel open. So that's basically why we did this idea here. Um, we basically took it from the front room and put it in the bedroom. So it opened up the bedroom even more, give us more walk space. And basically, you guys remember when I did the um, the vanity, the, pretty much the DIY vanity area or whatever. Basically, that's what the TV was on. And... This is what we pretty much did. So I'm liking it. Um, I just feel like it should come up a little bit more. Definitely the TV 
but it is eye level for if we land in the bed. It's, you know, it's not raised up all high and stuff like that. But I'm gonna have Dre to bring it up a tad little bit more, which it may just cover up the canvas some. Mm, as in probably about right there where the drip started at. Right, that's probably where it would go up to. Um, just so I could rise up the shelf in the fireplace a little bit more because it's down a little lower than what I expect it to be down. So, but other than that, I like it. But I'm still going to critique some things about it though. But I really do like how it look. Now, over here in this corner here, y'all already know where Dre um, have his um, bins at. That's because we still have not found a chest of drawer. That's pretty much what I'm looking for. Pretty much something to go with my aesthetics i want something mirror but i'm gonna have to find a way to protect it because of that door there when we open and close the door it slammed up against it everybody always slamming the door so i don't know if that's what i'm going to do as of right now if we don't put it there we'll put it over here behind me in the corner here next to the tv like turn it diagonal or something like that i don't know and probably get a floor mirror to put there i'm still debating about it it's out of these two areas where it's gonna go depending on how big it is so if we do decide to put the dresser there i'm just going to find something like a door stop or something so to prevent it from slamming against the door the door against the dresser or whatever but other than that i'm liking it um so if we do decide to do that route there we're just going to put a picture or something up there um think about changing this area here my vanity area because it's a little crowded now for me and i don't i didn't want that type of aesthetic looks of it so i'm going to play around with this area a little bit more something I don't know something have to change as of right now because it just a little too crowded for me i got some everything up there and that's not what i want to see when i walk in the room i still want the clean line fine line or whatever you know not the clutter look so i gotta figure out another way to do something with my palettes pretty much well everything over there girl. I, find, I gotta find a way to do something with all that but yeah um i didn't put this spread on the bed because it's still in a washer well yeah in a washer now at this point here but yeah this is the room y'all this is the room um i know someone gonna ask me about my chandelier because someone asked me about the chandelier that's over the dining room table that's actually a pending light that i just attached to the fan so it basically gave me a Fandelier, or however you pronounce it or whatever so it gave that little luxury look or whatever the glamorous look so all i did this is just a hanging pendant light that's why it's pretty much upside down um i would have put it that way but it wasn't wide enough to go over the screws the same way that i hooked it up in the closet the screws that hold the the bulb not the bulb the globe on the light i just removed that but kept the screws in there and i just attached it. it's just pretty much sitting on the screws that holding it up there so yeah um those are diys there same way i did the one in the closet that's pretty much what i did it just with some old pendant lights i had and i just used the base part and put some crystals on it um trying to see what else is a diy this is a diy here um all diys anything diy you can find on my diy channel uh, Valerie Glamorous Castle DIYs. I'm staying this now because I know we have a lot of new Queens and Kings because honey, yes, we're going to get to that one, baby. Because honey, we done made it to 6,000. Woohoo! Child, we on the road to 10K. Y'all don't, don't play with us. Play with your mama. But yeah, so this here is a little simple DIY where I got a storage bin from Lowe's, Ikea, or whatever the heck you want to get from Walmart or whatever. The bins, the push bins in there, and the mirrors and the knobs all came from Amazon. So I just glued them on the face of it so it gives the mirror effect. It's pretty much good, does what it needs to do, but if you put something too heavy, the knobs will come off like those down there. So that's why it's actually pretty much down there. Um, this is a DIY. This little stand here is a DIY. Let's see what else. Okay, these are DIYs here. I recently made these the end of the beginning of this year or the end of last year these canvas here these prints here came from the Cineo and the poster store because i did had a couple of you guys ask me for where i got it from so i don't know which one came from which but i just know it's out of those two sites there uh let me think what else um these little stackable books um, diys those are diys um this came from ross all this little bling set here these probably ross or home goods or something like that but this set and that and the pump there came from home goods 
my vanity diy vanity area is from bad cop furniture store these side tables here which dre cracked the one on the other side because his peacemaker fell on it and it cracked it so and they out of stock i can't find another one right now so I pretty much got that hiding but this little side table here came from amazon um these little vases here came from amazon and the biggest one i have in the bathroom came from z gallery um these mirror here came from old time pottery my bed is from amazon anything from amazon is linked down in my amazon storefront but if you guys want direct links just let me know that's what you want and i try to go back and get it you know come back and respond to you guys um so i think oh my pillow here is a diy this is basically just a placemat that i put um a backing on the back of it the same type of fabric that's on my couch as well as my chair here because this chair is a diy reupholstery i did on my diy channel i'm telling you all the diys you could find there on my diy channel those pillows there came from amazon this gray here came from amazon the purple i had for a minute is actually a twin size so that's why i use just like the end part as a throw or whatever so we do cover up with it from time to time these picture frames here is from burlington thing home goods or something this is a diy my wick cutter and the lighter is from amazon this tray here is from uh, i kill i believe uh, my curtains are from amazon the rods are from ikea the little hooks that holding up the curtain is from ikea that little guy that's over there he's from burlington as well as she is from burlington oh okay and these here are diys too these coasters here i used to make them and sell them i no longer do that because it's too much time consuming or whatever and then people don't be wanting to pay for your time so honey no so i stopped doing that there and it is what it is so what drake keep trying to get me to tell you guys about is my sconces here those are diys this is just the extra pendant like that's from lowe's um so those are diys my chanel canvas here is from oliver gal website tv husband brought it for me from last year not last year two christmas ago when we was in a four bedroom y'all know about that all these candle stands these sticks here these are diys too as well so yeah and those from home goods or something like that go check out jamie's channel jamie reached to 100 million subscribers okay so go check out jamie's channel and try to get her to 100 million subscribers as well as his mom oh and somebody have a birthday coming up march the 14th andre would be six years old so y'all want to see your little nephew something let me know and i'll let you know but um yeah anyway so that's pretty much gonna be it queens and kings i hope you guys enjoyed this clean with me it's pretty much a tour a full detailed tour try to give you as much as detail as possible because like i said i know we have did i say that but i know we have a lot of more queens and kings that have joined the castle over here joined the channel queen Val living and i just want to say i appreciate you guys so much what i was trying to say is i appreciate you guys so much I want to tell you guys this face to face um okay Dre. <laughs> so what i'm trying to say is i appreciate you guys so so much because we have reached six thousand subscribers Woo -hoo! i say subscribers well you know what supporters we have reached six thousand supporters because i'm not sure if you all six thousand queens or kings or whatever but most of you all are queens so it can't be but anyways queens and kings i hope you guys enjoyed this clean with me as well as this full tour detail or whatever updates that i have done in the room if you guys do please like comment share and subscribe i really truly appreciate it y'all we on our way to ten thousand, so let's keep on pushing it out there because i can't do it without you all at all because youtube not gonna let them know that we over here popping they're not gonna let them know we over here living so you guys continue to push them out continue to share continue to comment down below if i have not reached to your comment trust and believe i will go back and read your comment because i mean i have so many um and you guys when you guys like something you guys comment you comment on everything like i have like several comments from one person I'm like oh my god oh my god and i just get a little bit overwhelmed so if i heart it that means that i have read it 
if it's too much, if it's not a question or whatever, I'm definitely going to hoard it or whatever. Because a lot of you guys does say the same thing over and over. But I truly appreciate you guys. I love you guys so, so much. We love you guys so, so much. And thank you guys so much once again. So don't forget to comment because I, I do read them. I do read them. I might be a little bit late. Y'all know what I got going on over here. Full time mom, boss, wife mother you just it's full time everything over here so anyways queens and kings with that being said you guys continue to be raw and remember your crown may tip but it definitely won't fall Did I say something? okay like and subscribe like and subscribe y'all heard my baby bye bye <laughs>